What's going on guys and welcome back to another video. So today is going to be a bit different video from my past videos and so I'm going to be showing you guys a Bloxburg tutorial. Now actually before the video starts I do want to give a shout out. I will have to do shout out other day. So the shout out goes to Da Yuni. I'm so sorry if I'm saying your name wrong, but shout out to that person for hitting the notification bell and typing hashtag notification squad. If you want to be shouted out in the next video, all you have to do is do what they did. Hit notifications, set it to all, like the video, and then comment down hashtag notification squad. Now, let's get into the uh, I can't be, uh, I can't even say the tutorial. <laughs> let's get into the tutorial. Okay, so y'all, I've been working on this mansion for quite some time now, and I'm gonna just give you a little sneak peek. Okay, it looks pretty plain <laughs> in the hallway, bro. I, bro, I promise this isn't plain. Okay, you know what? No, I'm not gonna be that person that takes forever. I'm just gonna get straight in to the tutorial. So let me let me just find a bed. Quick, let me close these. Cause I don't want to show the full project off yet. So okay, no, no, no. Let, let me let me go upstairs because I don't want to show that one. So um, as you guys know, Bloxburg has a new tool update. What did I just open? Yes, I got an elevator. Leave me alone. <laughs> yeah, but Roblox, I mean, Bloxburg got a new tool update and it's called the transform tool, which was added like a few days ago. Please ignore the blank space, okay? <laughs> and so with this tool, you can basically drag an item up or down, side to side, rotate it, whichever you want to do with it. And so, as you guys know, you can do that with pillows and beds. But when okay, okay, let me just sit on right here. But when you place a pillow there, it just it's just stuck there. But I was just scrolling on TikTok one day. This isn't my method, by the way. I just found it on TikTok and I just thought, why not share it? Because this could really help out with bed designs. Not even bed designs, but like pillows i mean not pillows <laughs> couches so shout out to stanosaur for showing this tutorial because you're honestly a lifesaver we can add more designs like without the stupid um pillows clipping like watch y'all i'm gonna just let's just head into uh oh my god why did i press that man golly i meant to go in freaking build mode man Actually, let me just show y'all the bed I'm talking about first. I'm sorry I'm taking forever to get to the point because honestly, I hate when people do that in videos too, but <laughs> oh my God. Um, let's go back here. So this is the bed I made. Hold on, let's go into that mode. There we go. This is the bed I made and as you can see, there are no pillows clipping. Why? Because the pillow, hold on, can we go on the bed? It's actually underneath. And now all we have is this beautiful, realistic looking design. Now, if you want to do this, you will need the transform tool, which will, I think, require a game pass. So that's the only bummer part. But so now I'm going to just show you the whole bed design, but mainly the cushion part where you um, push it underneath the bed. All right. So, you know, what? enough talking left. Let's just head right into build mode. All right. So now let's just. I can show y'all how to do this whole bed in case someone's curious anyways. All right, yeah, let's just move this to the side. Now, all right, wait, bro. All right, let me get rid of these floating lamps real quick. There we go. All right, so what you wanna do is go into decorate mode and where's the beds? Here it is. Just get any bed you want. It can be any bed with a pillow. I'm gonna just select this one because as you can see, I'm going for a modern design. So we're just gonna put the bed right here. And also, uh, you can add the wood pillars if you want to. It's clipping through the ceiling a little bit. But, yeah. It's just like a headboard design I came up with. Okay, okay, okay. So, now you would want to grab a pillow real quick. Just any pillow. Actually, let's do a cheaper one. Yeah, I'd, I, I would grab a cheaper one if I were you guys. <laughs> so, just place it right where the previous pillows were. And then you want to click the transform tool. Oh my God, why isn't it clicking? All right, there we go. And then you wanna click on a pillow and then 
you will want to um, just drag it down. Drag it like just through the pillow and whoa, bam! the freaking pillow's gone. Look at that. Yeah, just like that, it's gone. So now you can um, actually hold on, hold on. Before we do anything, let me just change the bed color to this. Call it a day. <laughs> All right, there. So actually, I'm about to um, place a pillow right on the bed, of course. So you can just place it anywhere on the bed. Not here because it'll just clip right back to the pillow. I mean, to the spot it was previously in. So just drag it right there or not drag it, but like place it right there. And then you want to go into the transformation tool. Oh, actually, before you do that, I'd advise you to scale it to however you want first. So let's just, hold on, let me make this, there we go. Let's just do that, do that. That's perfect. All right, now you would want to rotate it however you'd like. I'm gonna just do it like, how, I'll just do it like this. Like then. And then you can just maneuver it however the freaking heck you want. Let's, let's just do that. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. And then you just want to copy this, place it near the middle or wherever you want. I'll just place it right here. And then use the transformation tool again. No. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Hold on, I'm trying to like, I want it like perfect. Like I'm like a perfectionist when it comes to uh building in Bloxburg. Also, this is my first ever project from scratch, like without YouTube videos and stuff. It's pretty crazy. Um, is that good? No, it ain't even good. It ain't even close to good. Yep. There we go. And then you can just add like little pillows here and there. Oh my God, guys, I totally forgot. Rewind before we put those two pillows down. <laughs> okay, so when you go into decorate it, you click new, you would wanna find this neatly tucked blanket. So we need this because, well, for all those um, builders out there that like to make everything look professional and realistic this will make the bed look a little bit more realistic so yeah I just I found this from them too by the way um the stinosaur so y'all y'all make sure to check out their Twitter uh, not Twitter but TikTok because they really came in clutch with this and we can also resize this or scale this which is also freaking dope um is that good you could choose the length the length yeah I think that's fine all right and now we're just gonna change it to this texture perfect perfect ah I can't grab it oh bro it's right there and look at that look a more realistic looking bed already of course we're gonna hide this part with the thingy but let's uh continue to place the pillow and now so if you guys want to add like the headboard and thing that I did, you would want to go to build and then basic shapes. So I used a cube for this one. So we're just going to place it in the middle and then we're going to resize it too. Now this part is difficult because, oh, actually I guess not. <laughs> I guess not. That was easy. We're just going to size it all the way. Oh, crap, I came in. All right, there we go. All right. And then just change it to this. See, look, it looks like it's part of the headboard already. Isn't that freaking dope? I know, it's pretty dope. And you can use um whichever cube, the basic cube or the rounded, where's the rounded? Beveled, whatever the freaking heck it's called. I think I'm gonna use the uh, cube for this front headboard thingy, my bobbers. So let's just do this. We're gonna size this down a little bit. Wait, oh crap, there we go. How many, wait, 
Uh, 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 uh. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Something like that. Something like that. Perfect. And then here's the finished product. I also forgot to uh, mention you can put a bench or you can just put whatever the freaking heck you want up there. But look at the masterpiece. Look at it. It's amazing. Isn't this dope? Like the creative minds. You can also sleep. Look at it. The, the freaking bed is actually matching the textures of the blankets we put. As you can see, you can do it on small beds as well. Just do the same thing we did with the larger bed and you'll be good. See, look, no pillow clipping at all. Also, it works on bunk beds as well. As you can tell, I kind of got lazy with this one. <laughs> but yeah, I got lazy with this one. I just placed the freaking up. Oh, oh my God. Also guys, it does work with couches i just found that out like literally as i was recording this <laughs> but it is a bit more trickier so so you can just choose any style of couches and then you want to grab your pillow again and so okay okay so this is what we're gonna do right we're gonna use the cheapest pillow as possible but this is literally the same whatever anyways and then we're gonna transform it down into the couch it should disappear i remember i was having issues with that couch but this couch is seeming like to cooperate with me all right there couch i mean the pillows are gone so you can actually i don't like the color of this hold on <laughs> all right so we're gonna grab a pillow another one of these you can be anyone which one would i want to choose actually i think i want a long one in the middle i don't know i'm not really good with decorating freaking couches man all right so let's just change the grid size and we're just gonna rotate it however you like and then we're just gonna drag it to the middle oh i didn't mean to do that dang i accidentally pressed the right click Holy, i hate when that happens i don't know if i can disable that all right well let's just dang let's drag this to the middle i guess that's perfect all right, and then we're gonna resize it to, let's just do it to like that. No, I don't freaking know. All right, that's perfect, that's perfect. All right, and then you can just place the pillows, godly, back to where the heck they were. There we go, a beautiful couch. What the heck was that? I don't know what that was. Look at this, bro, can I sit in the middle? Can, can, okay. Ha, ah, there we go. Ugh, I'm kind of clipping through though. What, Ah, that's okay. But you know what guys, I, I'm, I'm kind of sorry this tutorial took forever and stuff. <laughs> also guys, stay tuned for the full reveal of this mansion. I'm pretty sure I revealed a lot, God freakingly. But if you want to like an official tour, make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell because if you don't, I'm not gonna do it, man, I'm not. And you guys, you guys know how to do the shout out thing. I said that in the beginning of this video, but I'm going to end it here. Actually, let me delete this couch because your boy is getting broke. You know, I'm about to end here, y'all. Thank you so much. I hope this tutorial helped you out. And peace.